Hello everybody, Erica here back again. I am doing a purse comparison today. I am gonna be comparing the Mark by Mark Jacobs New Q Francesca Tote with the Mark by Mark Jacobs Classic Q Francesca Tote. So the Classic Q, this one, was the very first one that came around. And after the Classic Q came the New Q Francesca. So here's both of them side by side. Um, you'll notice that this one, um, it, it looks a little slightly more like softer leather. That's because it's, it's had years of wear. And so the leather has gotten time to get supple and soft. Whereas this one is brand, brand new. So the leather has had no wear. So it's a little bit um, more rigid, still soft, but more rigid. This one, the, the leather's gotten nice and buttery. So that's why you see the difference in leather, but it's, they're both the same, the same type of leather. Um, the, the difference between these two are in the details, really. Um, you'll notice that on the new Q, Francesca, the base of the handles are wrapped in leather. It has the hardware that ties the base with the rolled handles, and that's both in the front and in the back. On the classic Q, Francesca, you have uh, leather trimming stitched on, basically two layers of leather trimming with a bolt, the Marc Jacobs bolt in the center. Then you have the hardware that connects the base to the rolled handles and you have these little um, bolt details on the rolled handles. And that's both on the front and on the back. The other difference is on the Marc Jacobs plaque. This one's brand new, so it still has a little uh, protector there. But um, the plaque on the Classic Q is, uh, is taller and not as wide, whereas on the new Q, it's wider and not as tall. So here's side by side. You can see the difference. So that's the difference on that. So that's front and that's back. The pleating is again very similar. Uh, it only looks slightly different because this one, like I said, the classic Q has already been worn in and the new Q hasn't because it's brand new. They both retail for the same price um, well, the um, Classic Q retailed for the same price when it was out. You'll also notice that the shape is slightly, slightly different. The shape on the Classic Q Francesca, it has a little bit of a groove at the center, which makes it fall really nicely when you hold it, whereas the new Q is flat at the center. It doesn't have that curvature fall. And because of that um, curve on the classic, uh, height-wise, it seems shorter. You can see I'm holding them both, right? And the new cue behind it sticks out a little bit. So this one measures a little bit higher or taller than this one, but it's only because of the curvature in the bag. The dimensions at the bottom on both of them are the same. Uh, they're uh, at the bottom, it's 13 and a half inches on both. And um, the width at the top is the same also. At the top, it's 15 and a half inches uh, when, you extend, when you extend the tote out. Um, so the height is only because of this curvature. The other difference in size is the thickness, so the depth. So this one is five and a half inches deep, or this one is four inches deep. So that's in regards to the size. The other difference that you'll have, they both have this magnetic button on both of them. You'll see. And they both have this latch, but there's a difference in the latch. Um, you'll notice that on the new Q, this is what the latch on the new Q looks like. And the new Q has a smaller latch. The classic Q has a bigger latch. And it's slightly different. The sides here are flat where the sides on this latch are curved. So that's, the latch is just bigger. And that goes the same for the latch for the crossbody strap. It is bigger on the classic Q Francesca and smaller on the new Q Francesca. 
again, those are all the things that I, I, I believe uh, contribute to this bag being a little bit heavier than this bag. Not by much. I only know and I only noticed because I actually waited, but um, I don't think you would notice the difference on your shoulder. Um, another difference with these bags are um, the lining. The new Q Francesca, the lining matches the bag. So it's, in this case, it's the India ink color that matches uh, the color of the bag. And on the classic Q, it has the classic Marc Jacobs lining, the black and white lining that you're used to see it, seeing. And this one is more of a nylon feel, whereas the new Q Francesca is more of a cloth feel. Um, Additionally, the new Q Francesca has, one wall of the bag has a zipper uh, pocket, and right in the center of it, it has a little leather piece where the brand was put in, so the Marc Jacobs brand. And on the classic Q, the zipper is actually bordered with leather, so trimmed with leather. So the zipper is trimmed with leather, and the brand is right underneath, imprinted on the uh, border of the um, of the zipper. So that's that's a big difference in look, if you could see. The other side, the other wall of the bag has on the new Q Francesca, you have two slip pockets and they're both the same size. On the classic Q Francesca, you also have two slip pockets, but one is smaller and one is bigger. So that's, that's that. So that's basically um, the main differences between the two. Um, here they are, uh, both extended out side by side so you can see them. If you can see the curves, I don't know, I, I tend to like the curves on this one, but they're both pretty much the same. Um, and they're both beautiful and they hold the same amount of things in there. So there you have it. The Mark by Mark Jacobs New Q Francesca Tote and the Mark by Mark Jacobs Classic Q Francesca Tote. Feel free to let me know which one you like better. Um, I hope you like this video. If you have any questions, please comment. If you like it, hit like and subscribe. Thank you. Have a great day.